Hello, who are you? I'm the guy, Chris, that you messaged online. Oh, oh, yes, yes, come in, come in. Yes, good. So, you're worried about your meme. You're, how did you put it? You want to kill it off, did you say? Yes. Yes, that's the problem. Your whole premise, it's wrong. What? Come here. You can't just kill me. But memes die all the time. From overuse, yes. It's not like their creator comes along and declares them dead and then they're dead. Member Pepe, his creator did that, and that just gave him new life. But I'm not trying to stop people from using it, I just don't know what to do with it. No, 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 no. Every meme, three components. The core, the medium, and the shell. For example, the core of your meme is the biblical reference. The first shall be last, yes? It's also because people on YouTube comment first. Exactly. That is the medium. Whoa! This is the space your joke lives in. Uh, for you, that's any YouTube comment section where people have read the Bible. So what's the shell for then? Oh, Chris, the shell is what differentiates a dank meme from just a joke someone makes online. It's what protects the core joke and allows it to travel around the internet, infecting the entire thing like a viral infection. But Joe, this doesn't make sense. Are you making this up as we go along? No, no, this is science. See, like a weapon in Breath of the Wild, the shell has durability, and after time, it starts breaking. But what about memes that stick around for a long time? No, no, no. See, there's a way to refresh the shell, give it a nice reboot. Sometimes, even after the first shell has already broken. What on earth is that? This, my friend, is a layer of irony. So what you're saying is, you can keep a meme alive if you make fun of it? Exactly. But, see, once you have the layer of irony, it's harder to maintain. You're not working in this medium anymore. You're working in this medium. And this whole first layer is now your new core, and it moves around in this medium. That makes sense. You do have to have context. Bingo bongo. See, without context, the second layer will break, and the meme dies again. So, how does this help me? It doesn't. Like I said, a creator can't kill a meme. If you do, it gains a new layer of irony and is born anew. But if you try too hard to breathe new life into it yourself, then it'll die. So the last time that I use it will be the first time that's reinvented. And if I keep using it, it'll die and it'll be the end. So in other words, the last shall be first, and the first shall be... Dang it, Joe!